Hey everybody, this is your weekly wisdom from Sterling Johnston Real Estate. Today we're going to talk about the truth. Now, the truth for real estate brokers and small business owners, which every real estate broker is, is, is one of the hardest and sometimes most painful things to take a look at. We oftentimes know what we're supposed to do in terms of lead generation or running our business, but we just don't do those things. Um, so what my partners and I have done here at Sterling Johnston, we've had to develop some tools over time to make sure that, that we are doing the right things, that we're not ignoring the truth, and that the things that we're doing at any moment during the day are the things that are going to propel our business forward. And so we want to share some of those things with you guys here uh, so that you can benefit from them. So a couple of the, the, the ways that we have looked at this over the years to, again, make ourselves more honest about what we're actually doing and what we should be doing. The first one is to ask ourselves, what would a consultant say? So if you're looking at your business, if you're going to get up tomorrow morning and you are going to do your real estate activities, maybe you're showing houses, maybe you're writing up a contract, uh, but every day there should be some lead generation activities. And it's usually with the lead generation activities where this is the most difficult for us, for most people. So when you get up tomorrow and you're thinking about what would a consultant, if they were looking at me getting up, getting started with my day, what should I be doing? What would they recommend? Usually it's not what we do. It's not the thing, what the consultant would say is not necessarily what we would do. It's a good exercise. It, it causes us to be objective about what really matters. The other way to think about it, another way to ask the question is, what would you expect from an, an employee? So since you're running your own business, you have a choice whether you could go out and get a job and make a living that way or be a real estate broker. So you are essentially the employee in this scenario, in this perspective. So. If you ask yourself, if I had to hire somebody tomorrow and they were going to come and they were going to do my job, what would my expectation be of them? If that person, that employee said, well, Eric, I've, you know, I've spent 10 or 15 minutes on lead generation and I just, I'm, I can't do it anymore. I'm going to go do this or that, or I have houses to show this afternoon, or I have other real estate activity to do. Would you believe it? Would you buy it? Would you be willing to pay that person the salary that you're paying them and accept that? Or would you challenge it? So if what we're telling ourselves as that employee are things that aren't true, that if there was a real employee in that situation, that you wouldn't allow that to happen, then we have to tell ourselves the truth. We have to be willing to look at that objectively and have that same conversation with ourselves that we should be having or would be having with that employee. So think about this. Think about the, the perspective. Be objective. Seek the truth. And that's your uh, weekly wisdom from Sterling Johnston. Do great things, brokers. Thank you.